What I'm going to try and do throughout this workshop is give you little tips that will help you when you come across things that otherwise get frustrating. Because I think that you know, once you get over all these frustrations, this is such an amazing program. It's like you can't not but fall in love with it. But all the frustrations can, can get to you before then. So, um, and if I just click with the space bar, it centers it. I'm going to move it a bit to the left. Good. We're not going to worry too much about what else is in the toolbox. We can come back to that as we need it. Now, the core of a painter is the brushes. And I started off this workshop ho holding the palette and the brush and emphasizing this is about painting. You know, painter has sophisticated effects, very sophisticated effects. It has filters, and you can bring in your plugins uh, you know, that you use in Photoshop. So we're going to talk about all that. It has amazing, amazing effects. But when it comes down to the core of what is painter really good for, what's it really special for, why should I make the effort to spend all this time learning yet another program, and especially one with so much in it? This is, you know, it's all about the brushes. And so when you, so the key part of this circle here is going to be uh, up here in the top left corner, and that is the brush selector. And um, so just uh, as I touched on in my demo earlier, little demo, we basically have two columns, and uh, we also have a dynamic preview. So as I go up and hold my cursor over every variant, look at the, look at the preview at the bottom of that um, column, and you'll see it's reflecting whatever brush. Do you see that I, I'm using and showing the size and everything? Um, so it's actually really good because one of the challenges has always been oh, hundreds of names of brushes. I have no idea which brush is which, what it's going to look like. I, you know, am I going to spend hours and hours and hours going through every one of the hundreds? Some people do, and you know, over the years, I, I do, and I forget what I did at the beginning when I've gone through them all. It's like, you know, it's tough trying to remember what brushes are going to work for you, and then to remember how to get back to them. That's what we're going to be looking at some answers to that. 